crazy busy mama, let's make some bruschetta. One of our very favorite things to eat in this house is bruschetta. Start with toasting some French bread, slice it, and then you wanna take infused olive oil. If you're not using infused oils in your cooking, you're missing out. This cilantro and roasted oven from Olivino is our favorite. You can check out details in my bio. Then take some grape or cherry tomatoes and diagonally cut them. Once you've cut them in half, diagonally cut again. Put the opposite ends together and it makes a super cute heart. Adorable, right? Now take that fresh sliced mozzarella cheese. This one's already cut, so I'm just breaking it apart. And grab that ghost cookie cutter. You can make a variety of different shapes of ghosts for even more bouchetta fun. Seriously though, isn't this adorable? Puts a fun twist on Halloween treats and keeps them not sweet. I don't know about you, but I get over the sugar very quickly. So having something like this that's festive is definitely a favorite of mine. Using peppercorn as eyes and the nose, you simply create each bouchetta. And remember those hearts that we made? We're gonna put them right in the middle, giving each and every little ghost a little heart to hold on to and use up those little scraps to make those arms so nothing is wasted. You can make as little or as many as you'd like, but they will sure be a conversation piece on that spooky spread for Halloween. Aren't they so stinking cute and so easy to make too. Don't forget to follow Crazy Busy Mama for more holiday fun.